Use a T30-bit to remove the four screws securing the front frame. Use a T30-bit to remove the two screws securing the front cover. Use a T20-bit to remove the screw securing the connector clamp. Use a T30-bit to remove the five screws securing the protective cover. Use a T20-bit to remove the two screws securing the decorative cover. Unbuckle the connector attached to the cover. Use an 18mm socket to remove the steering wheel. Use a T30 bit to remove the four screws securing the manual panel. Use a T20 bit to remove the two screws securing the clamping plate. Unplug the two connectors. Remove the cotter pin to separate the pull rod from the support plate assembly. Use a T10 bit to remove the two screws securing the USB port. Unplug the main cable and remove the manual panel assembly. Use a T15-bit to remove the four screws securing the charging port. Use a T15-bit to remove the screw securing the clamping plate and unplug the connector. Use a T15-bit to remove the four screws securing the clamping plate and protector cover. Use a T15-bit to remove the screw securing the clamping plate and unplug the connector. Use a T15-bit to remove the seven screws securing the LCD screen. Use a T15-bit to remove the seven screws securing the key slot. Use a T15-bit to remove the seven screws securing the operational panel control electrical assembly. Replace with a new operational panel control electrical assembly and tighten with the seven screws. Tighten the LCD screen with the seven screws. Tighten the blue connector with screw. Tighten the clamping plate and protector cover with the four screws. Tighten the key slot with the screw. Tighten the clamping plate and the connector with the screw. Tighten the charging port with the four screws. Tighten the manual panel assembly with the four screws. Tighten the steering wheel with the bolt. Secure cotter pin and the pull rod to the support plate assembly. Plug in the main cable. Plug the two connectors and tighten with the two screws. Tighten the two screws to secure the USB port. Plug the connector and tighten the decorative cover with the two screws. Tighten the protective cover with the five screws. Plug the connector and tighten with the screw. Tighten the front cover with the two screws.
Tighten the front frame with the four screws.